Hello and welcome back to episode 21 of Terminology Tuesday. Terminology Tuesday is where I have a term of the week and I break down what it means and where it fits into the bigger picture that is the sport of dodgeball. And this week's term of the week is attack line versus neutral zone. So today I'm going to break down the differences between the two. So let's jump right into it. So in the WDBF foam rules, you use an attack line. So the attack line is three meters from and parallel to the center line on both halves of the court. So the attack line is solely used during the opening rush. So during the opening rush, each ball must clear the attack line in order to become a live ball. In the WDBF rules for cloth, there is a neutral zone. So the neutral zone is the space between each team's attack lines. So both teams can be anywhere within the neutral zone. So you could have a scenario where you have a player from the opposing team actually behind you. So you do need to pay attention and be careful. Now, players cannot cross the, their opposing team's neutral zone line into the other team's fair territory. So crossing it would mean either stepping over the line or on the line, because it is, again, hard line rules in WDBF. Players can reach across the neutral zone line in order to attempt to retrieve a ball. Just like in WDBF foam, where you can reach across the center line to try and retrieve a ball. So players from opposing teams cannot make contact in the neutral zone. If contact happens, the player that initiated the contact will be called out, whether it was on purpose or on accident. So that's pretty much the basics when it comes to the attack line and the neutral zone. If you enjoyed this video and you found it helpful, please give it a like and subscribe to the channel. It really helps get my content out there and helps me with the YouTube algorithm. And my whole goal is to get dodgeball in front of more people's faces. And if you have any other topics with Terminology Tuesday you'd like me to cover, drop it in the comments and I'll see you guys in the next one.